Hello guys and welcome to a video by me Bullet of Bullets. In this video I'm going to be showing you a really good piece of software um, which actually I was really surprised about. Um, now I've done a video before on a Windows 7 transformation pack and what that done was it changed your taskbar, it changed inside here, um, it changed your icons, it changed the whole of your backgrounds and um, all the icons and literally everything possible to um, Windows 7. However, I now have something slightly different for you, um, which I think is still really, really good, but it's much quicker. Now, this program is called um, VGlance One Step. Now, this is an absolutely amazing program, and I was gobsmacked by it, I really was. Um, now, literally, all you do is you go to the site, you download it. Once you download it, it's just a small zip. You unzip it, and it's just got three files in it. This, the leesoft.com, and this. I think they came with it. I'm not 100% sure, but I think they did. Um, now, this basically it doesn't change all of your icons, and it doesn't change the whole of your background, and the look in my computer, and things like that. However, this changes the whole of your start bar, and it's a really good, quick, actually, quick change actually and I really do like it now what I have to do is double click this I don't have to reboot, I don't have to restart, nothing like that just literally double click it and it will do it while I'm watching it will come up vglance installing, initializing even and automatically it's done um, so if I just quit out of this again I can see straight away it goes back to how it was double click on it again and as you can see it, it's just done it now you have, I know it's not exactly how the Windows 7 bar looks at all I know it's not um, but it's still kind of different, so I thought I'd do it. And I'd show you anyway. Um, now that's hanging over because I'm obviously using Camtasia, and it does flash. It's, called, it's a weird thing that comes up called flashing when it does it. As you can see, it highlights when I go over to it, and when I'm not over it, it doesn't highlight. And I go over it again, it does that. Um, it's got now the Windows 7 part. However, um, when you actually click into this, it still stays the same as it would be on XP because I'm on XP. Um, but that doesn't really bother me at all, it's still the front of it looks the same um, now mainly people, what, what people like is this part and I'll open a couple more programs up just so I can show you what I'm on about right, what a lot of people like is the fact that you have this and you have your the weird square buttons rather than the long, the long rectangle ones and plus the fact you can hang over it and it will come up like this and you click there and it will come up instead what people also like is the fact that, that you can also pin things to your thing so that's not to your uh, bar so no longer is that there because I've closed it however if I go back into it again as are you can do on Windows 7 you can right click it and click pin now as you can see that's down there and when I go out of it it still stays there the icon because of the fact that it's now pinned um, and I can literally click it again it brings me into it same as Windows 7 does however this isn't pinned so if I just go out of it, it won't stay there because it's not pinned again. However, if I go into Opera again and then pin it, it will then stay there. And I can then go out of that and it will stay there still. And the same for Cam Studio. Um, so basically, it's got the, as I made it quite clear, um, you, you've got the pinning part still. However, when you're not in this and you right click on something to pin, which I'll open Notepad, it obviously won't do anything because it doesn't do that. It just comes up with maximum maximize, minimize and close and all that. So um although it doesn't hundred percent look like or really at all um seven doesn't look like Windows seven. It is a really good piece of software. Because most software like this you have to shut your computer down or reboot or stuff like that to get it to work. And then sometimes it doesn't even work. Um but this software is good. I do like the look of it. Um and I do like the way that it can hang over to tell you what it says. Um this is just a video by me, Bullet Bullets, on a video called uh, on a piece of software, sorry, called VGlance One Step. I'll leave the link in the description to go download it. Um, so this is a video by me, Bullet Bullets. If you like my videos, please do comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching.